At an alien lair, the hybrid commander is informed of an individual leaking the alien's operations to the authorities for several months. The source of the leak has been located, Max Tennyson. The commander orders that Max be eliminated to prevent further interference with their plans. A soccer game is shown, being held at Ben Tennyson's school. Ben, now 15, is his team's goalkeeper, while bullies Cash and JT are among the opposing team. With little time left, Cash and JT nearly score a goal, but are stopped by Ben just as the time stops. Following the match, Ben meets a girl named Julie Yamamoto, who congratulates him on his victory. Ben bikes to his grandfather's RV, the rust bucket and knocks on the door, unaware he is being watched. When no one answers, Ben sees that the lights inside are off. He finds the vehicle's key and manages to enter, finding the interior ransacked. The bathroom is empty despite supposed noises coming from inside. As he is leaving, Ben is attacked by a Dnalian and is unable to defend himself without the Omnitrix. The Dnalian momentarily loses sight of Ben, who takes advantage of the situation and scares off the alien with a fire extinguisher. Ben attempts operating the vehicle's dashboard when a compartment opens with a device inside. The device contains a pre-recorded holographic message from Max, who informs Ben of renewed alien activity on Earth, that he is investigating, and that the Omnitrix is safe with Ben. Ben does not notice the appearance of an alien on the recording as it ends. Ben rushes home to see if Max was serious, the Omnitrix is indeed there in his room inside a box, Ben is confused of Max's motives. Ben leaves to see Gwen at her karate class. Ben tells her he needs her advice on something, he shows her the recording, believing Max is telling him to begin reusing the Omnitrix, but Gwen disagrees, remembering that it was always Ben's choice as to whether or not he wanted to use it. Ben says how he used to feel special wearing the watch, but Gwen tells Ben he was the one that was special. She warns that his regular teenage life will come to an end once he starts using the Omnitrix again, but Ben is confident Max is in need of his help. The man watching Ben at the rust bucket reappears asking for the Omnitrix. Ben refuses and attempts to run, but the man pursues them and reveals himself to in fact be an alien known as Magister Labrad. He shoots Ben when the latter attempts to run. Gwen harnesses her greatly enhanced magical prowess to restrain Labrad, they interrogate him and learn he is a plumber like Max. He reports that Max went missing in the middle of a case. The Magister suddenly realizes who he's talking to and apologizes for mistaking Ben for a random thieving child. He agrees to help them find Max. Ben then decides to wear the Omnitrix.